Last time on Pokemon Sapphire Hard Mode. Arrival in Slate Park. A good Pokemon silenced forever. And a robbery attempt thwarted. Hi, I'm Rashu, and thanks for watching my Let's Play of Pokemon Sapphire Hard Mode. Now we've defeated uh, whoever they were. Now that that's done, we can move on. We've delivered what we needed to Steven. Forget if we need to talk to someone in here. Apparently, uh, engineering is an art and not a science. That's a dangerous thought to entertain. No, it doesn't look like a sandwich shot. That's mostly important. I'll we'll check the market out later. For now, I think we should visit the Pokemon Mart, though. And I'm gonna buy a couple super potions. I don't want to buy too many because there is a better place to get healing items really close by. But we need to beat some trainers first. And right now, I don't know if we're quite up to that. Pokemon. It's someone new on the team. This is Harbor. Search sharply. Bushed. Hiked all the way from Alba. This is huge. So, we can get bikes in Mallville. That is good to know. And our newest member is a Wingull. Huh. Well, this could be dangerous. I don't think it can take me down in one hit, so. Unless I get confused and hurt myself in confusion. Switch out. Didn't heal. Oh, we're off to a good start. Good, supersonic mist. So that's Ember. Ember's not going to be very effective. Wingull is a water flying type. So we finally get a water type. That is a good thing. Not so good at the next gym, but we'll worry about that when it happens. For now, the wing off. Now, what does this say? Wingull rides updraft, rising from the sea by extending its long and narrow wings to glide. This Pokemon's long beak is useful for catching prey. So, do we want to give a nickname? Yes. What do we want to nickname Wingull? Wingull. Wingull is a water seagull. It's a water flying Wingull. Seagull. Seagull is deeper. Seagull. No, I don't like that. It is male. Steven. I can't think of anything better right now.
but we'll be going with the cool spelling of it. So now we apparently need to heal. So what I'm thinking I'm gonna do now, since we clearly are not in a position to fight trainers in the area, having only one strong, oops, having only one strong Pokemon right now, and a few sort of left last track, I think it's inevitable that I need to try grinding. So I'm just gonna be playing it safe and switching out to my fire type. And if anyone gets close to fainting, I'll turn the video on, otherwise I'm going to spare you all needing to worry about grinding. So, when I next speak to you in a couple seconds, you'll see a rapid development in the levels. So, until then, taking a quick break from grinding just to heal up. Not that they're that low in health, but a couple of mine have been paralyzed, which would be really annoying for grinding, so just keeping you all up to date. So far, all that's really happened is Fat Guts went up one level. I'll cut back every time I use the Pokemon Center so you can see what's going on. Otherwise, you'll hear from me when some more has happened. More has happened. As you can see, Jay went up two levels. Fat Guts went up one. Steven went up one. And though you can't tell, Roosterne also went up one. What I did with Roosterne is made Roosterne forget Peck, and instead, Roosterne now knows Sand Attack. Plus, Zagon got an item. We got a super potion from Zagon. That's sweet. So I'm thinking of trying to get everyone to roughly 15 or so, minus Zagon. And if we can do that, then we're going to uh, challenge the trainers at the beach. So, back I go. But you don't need to. Just a quick update to show you the team. Oh, well, let's take a look. Steven is level 13. Had a new nature, won't give up. It has those stats of alright speed, special attack, critical missile attack, it has wing attack, supersonic water gun, and growl. And we have Combustion. Roostern, as I told you, has that move set now. We have J at level 14 now, with wing attack. Nothing changed. And Fat Guts is level 13 with Vital Throw. And what Vital Throw is, it makes the uh, user go last, but it never misses and has a base power of 70, so it's a pretty strong attack. So I guess currently where the team is at, we're almost at our goal. I think one more pass will be enough to get us to where we need to be and fight those trainers. So, I'm going to do one more sweep of uh, grinding, get my team to 15, and then we are going to fight some Pokemon trainers. Quickest sweep ever, let me tell ya. I mean, we're already here and back again, and look at the team. Holy field, ready to go. All 15 or higher. So. Steven instantly doesn't lose accuracy. Has those stats now. Roostern has leveled up to level 22. Jay is level 15 and has these stats. And Fat Guts is level 15 and has these stats. 
actually a pretty respectful attack for level 15. No rooster in stats, but rooster has already evolved once and is pretty, like several levels higher. Let's also find out what this is. Ooh, a full heal. Full heals will heal any stats. Any. So we're going to try a trainer battle now. And yeah, we'll keep Steven out front. There's lots of sailors out there. At least we will have some water resistance going on. And we're going into this house. Show me how great Pokemon are. Ooh. In turn, I'll show you how great mine are. Yeah. Take that, Simon, you tuber. Azrael. Azrael is a new Pokemon in this. It's the baby form of Meryl. And, as I'll prove right now, contrary to popular belief, it is a normal type. Doll. Oh, it is so charming. So cute. Or something. Flashes. <coughs> this is Meryl. It's an all form. This is a basic one, and this one is water. So we're gonna wing attack this one. So they can actually stand up on it. I'm not gonna have a repeat of the last water gun we faced. Ugh. That, that still doesn't bode well. It just this whole beach is a horrible place. And if, I'm sure that if we'd done this trainer before that one, we'd have gone a lot different. Because this trainer seems to be a lot easier. I don't think that's just level stopping. Tuber. Boss, we don't cry. Now go compliment a meal or something. I mean, who needs a tuber, really? Yeah, we don't want all this new wine. What do you have to say? Beauty, Johanna. Johanna. Joanna. How, how do you pronounce that? Golding really needs no introduction. One of the original 150. There's a water attack, there's a flying attack. That's how it always has to That's hot. Oh, is it? Take that. Uh -huh. Suddenly I feel like drinking soda pop. I wonder why. Yar. We'll be trying this trainer then. Wingle versus Wingle. Alright. Steven, you can do this. Sailors like in their fighting types. Sure, it's good for loading things on the docks, but really, really in a way, I associate with sailors. Maybe, maybe I need to start thinking more Popeye. I don't know. Popeye would be like a fighting type. He needs a sailor, so maybe there's that tentacle. So many tentacles. Yay, some softness. So many tentacles. 
And take that Dwayne. What is a hot battle? Now that those are done. We're scorching hot. Those battles blaze. With more to be satisfied. We get half a dozen uh, soda pops. I sure feel like buying soda pops right now. It's the end of the bottle. And it honestly heals more than a super potion. You need to buy one at a time, but it also will make the Pokemon happy. So if we end up ever catching something that uh, evolves with happiness, we'll be using these then too. on the beach, but we'll save that for another time. Feeling invigorated after uh, much training in Slate Park, we prepare for what lies ahead. Will we be ready to face everyone at the beach? Tune in next time to find out.